Hello, have you seen the organic theme? This design has some pretty cool features. I love the hover effects on the images that make them light up. I'm also a really big fan of the navigation menu. For large screens, the menu runs horizontally, while for smaller devices, it collapses to a nice mobile menu that when triggered slides onto the screen. So today I'm going to demonstrate how you would edit this menu to accommodate new pages in the project. I'm going to zoom in on the canvas to make it easier for you to see what actions I take. At the top, when mousing over the elements, I can see that the menu text link elements are grouped together in a container element. I could drag and drop another text link um, element over to the canvas, but I think it's just easier to duplicate one that is already there. So hovering over any of these three menu items, you'll see the context menu uh, with options appear. I'm gonna hover over one and click on that duplicate button and then double click um, or use that A on hover to then um, launch the text editor to change out the words. In this case, I'm changing the link to say events. Now I need to link where I want this menu option to go. On the element pane under properties, the link destination can be entered over in the um, href box. However, the new page um, has not yet been created in the project. I'll show you how to do that. So click on the pages toolbar icon. The ability to duplicate an existing page or add a blank page to the project, I'm gonna choose blank. With the blank page created, I will go back up to pages and choose manage project. Um, here I can enter a page name and title, in this case events. You can also enter keywords, description, and other fun stuff um, in this panel as well. With the page created, it can now be linked to uh, from the menu. Uh, the menu is saved as a symbol under the content pane. Uh, this way the menu can be reused and kept in sync across all the pages in the project. I'll click on Add to Canvas and it will pop right there up on screen. As you can see, that new menu for the events page is there since it was saved as the symbol. Now to apply the link URL, go back to the element pane and properties and in the href box, enter the page name events. It will also appear in a helpful drop-down list for you as well. Now, if I go to another page within the website, um, you can see that the link URL has been um, updated automatically. Just a very cool benefit of using the symbols. Now, the last update that will need to be made is to the mobile menu. These links are off screen until activated. Using the element tree, I will select the parent container for the mobile menu. It has the class name side nav. From the uh, styles pane in the type, uh, in the type class box, um, I'm going to add the class name CFS dash show dash menu. That will bring that off screen menu into view on the canvas so I can style it. I'm going to repeat my actions for duplicating that text link element. And to change out the text, I'm going to right click and select edit text to change that wording to say events. Then the last thing to adjust is that link info again over in the element properties. After completing the changes to the mobile menu, I will go back to that side nav parent container and remove that CFS show menu class. This way it rehides the menu back off screen. 
rinse and repeat as many times as you need when changing out your menu items. Thanks for joining me.